it's Emma and Steve from Showhams Online. We're at Heritage Park today in Tutbury, Staffordshire, an outstanding development by Peveril Homes. This is the five bedroom Sudbury show home. This exceptional home has three floors of living space and oodles of character. Come with us and take a look around. Welcome to the Sudbury. Hello. Yes. Oh gosh, I'm getting blown away. Now another Peveril. Pever God, do you know I'm having a lot of trouble saying it's this. Pever right, we, you will say the word. Pever okay. It's not that I'm illiterate or anything. Pever well, we've got another beautiful house called the Sudbury yes. on Heritage Park in Tutbury. Yeah. Great. So great yes. hallway. This is a bit brighter, isn't it? This looks epic. Yeah. Right. Let's take a look in the lounge first of all. Okay. It's again, it's another full length it of the house jobby, isn't it? Very, very spacious lounge. Yeah. So, French doors to the rear. Really lovely. This lounge is huge. Yeah, it is. They've got some seriously big pieces of furniture and it, they're not dwarf at no, all. It's no, no. So and big. you've got those ceiling to floor curtains there. Yeah, I do like that. If you, if you turn around there, look, you can see them on that wall. Because that yeah. window, I think in proportion to the room, the window is quite small. Yeah. But that's that indicative end. of this Regency yeah. style, isn't it? It is, yeah. Okay. They're never big on windows. The, uh, lounge diner. Very nice. Yeah. So again, this little bit of this has been pushed out a little bit, the dining yes, room right there, hasn't it? it? Yeah. But it's nice, another pe a set of French doors there. Um, it just gives you that extra bit of space yeah. for, your, for your dining area. We've got some lo lovely down lighters as well. Mm. Very, very nice. I mean, this planked wallpaper, you're seeing it everywhere at the moment. It's bang on, bang on trend. Nice shabby chic. Um, yeah, it is, it's lovely. Beautiful clock. kitchen here. So this is slightly... A slightly higher spec than the other show home on this uh, yeah. development. So you've got a very nice fitted kitchen. Love the beautiful work surface. I would think you've got integrated appliances yet. There's your dishwasher. Um, plenty of cupboards and drawers. There's your hob, so the electric hob. Uh, you've got a utility room with this, this house. Huh? Look at the you doors. I actually, just pause for a minute and look at the quality of the doors. Quality of the door furnishings. Yeah. They're not your average mm -hmm. doors, are they? Very nice. Aren't they? Yeah. yeah. Um, if you come in, because I need to show you behind the door. Okay. So here, you've got lots and lots of storage, cupboards. You've got a space there for an appliance. And then, oh, there's another one there. But you could fit two in yeah. if you wanted to. So you've got your door there to the back garden. Do you know, we do know a dog called Maisie, don't we? She'd mm -hmm. like that bowl. <coughs> How lovely. And then you've got your boiler in there. Again, another Bailey boiler. Yeah. And but a sink in a utility. Are you not Maisie rhymes with? Lazy. And that is a lazy dog. Yeah. Right, so we've got a cupboard here under the stairs. That's quite nice. Isn't we just it? we just got to work on that. Emma opening the door as I come in through Sorry. the door. Yes. I think she's. I think I know you say oh, I've got to add a few I'm more pans around. Away. There you go. There's a very nice. Yeah. Basket hanging thing there. Right, we've got another door here then. It's your downstairs cloakroom. That's pretty, isn't Interesting, it? Interesting. Yeah. Very nice. Size loo. And a large huge study. Yeah. Yes. With a huge light fitting. There's you a know, lot. There's no danger of banging our heads, Steve, no, is there? Because no. that's something that we do find in some show homes is that these huge, lovely light fittings are so low yeah. that I walk into them. But the ceilings are tremendous in this house. 
You're not short of space in, no, in it's fabulous. So it's really nice. Look at this. I don't really film the stairs much, but the pool paper running up there just invites it's you up there, doesn't decorated it? decorated house. Right, let's take a look up to the first floor. Okay, first floor. Uh, oh, and we have another floor as we well. We do, yes. Right. Now, we're not going to try and, we're, we're not going to try and guess the bedrooms because no. we don't have plans for these houses. But what we will do is Emma will have put them already. Oh, yeah. So you'll already know what we've yeah, done. Yeah, because they'll be on the yeah. on the graphic below. Right, so this bedroom is above the lounge and at the front of the house. Got those gorgeous views again. So that's got a fitted wardrobe in that one. Yeah, and it's got an ensuite. There we go, if I open the door for you. Beautifully, beautifully styled in terms of Now we haven't, we haven't reviewed um, Pevel. Pevel homes before. Yeah. What sort of feel do their houses give you? Stylish, classic. They're very nice. Indeed. Yeah. I think each developer gives They're you a different very, feel. very spacious as well. You feel like yeah. you get a lot of house for yeah. your money, I think. Particularly with the head heights. Next bedroom. The interior design is lovely. Pretty bedroom, isn't yeah. it? Now you can see there <laughs> we've got a branch which has got a couple of little things hanging off it. Take a look at the back, just at the back of this house, these houses. Look at these lovely mature trees that have just been integrated into the, the design of the estate and you can see the houses look as good at the back as they do at the front you can see over there just a little snippet of the the park there lovely traditional houses aren't they mm. but what i want to know now you can see this can't you you can see this twig now in alton towers there is the same kind of thing there's a big twig and it's part of a ride can anybody tell me what that ride is that that is about the branch. That's a little question for, because Alton Towers isn't too far away from here either. No. Main bathroom. Gosh, what a big size. Got the Rosh and um, Sanctuary. So within this, you get an independent, um, an independent shower there as well. Yeah. It's really good. It's impeccably tiled as well. For the ammonites as well. Another bedroom, a big bedroom. So we're at the rear of the house again. I have just got a feeling I know who's designed this show home. I've got a feeling and we it's know got them. An <laughs> Possibly. Yeah. A lot of interior designers. Yeah. The wallpaper look lockers. Yeah. Gosh, that brings back memories of school for me. Big bedroom, isn't so we've it? got a shared ensuite now. Oh, it's a uh, now then, Sebastian. Yeah. What? Yes. Now traditionally, this would be called a Jack and Jill, but we have one viewer that thinks that that's not quite right. Yeah, Sebastian. Yes. I hope you're watching this. So we're now going to change this configuration. Yeah. To Sebastian to the Sebastian room. Okay. Well. We well, we don't know what Sebastian's partner's called, so yes. we'll just go with the Sebastian room, okay? It's all about equality, isn't it? it absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. So. And maybe you know I mean? a Jack and Jill is quite mainstream, isn't it? So, yeah. You know, yeah. We need to think of something else. Anyway, yeah. so you have got a bathroom that is shared by both bedrooms. Yeah. There you go. It's got a good, it's nice. It's got a shower. Yeah. That's a nice looking yeah. shower, actually, isn't it? Yeah. And then through into another lovely uh, double bedroom. Look at the scarf. It's oh. it's tapes. Really, really like that. I wonder where that came from. That is so pretty. Gosh, lots of lovely, I think we'll ask the sales negotiator who shiny the bits. interior designer is on this particular yeah. house. It's lovely. It is, isn't it? The flooring's nice in here as well. Done away with carpet. Do you know we did a review for a developer, a very small developer, not long ago, and they had all the little nicks and knacks about, didn't they? 
yeah. and this is kind of yeah very very nice so there are four bedrooms then on this level it's a beautiful big hallway this landing yeah so it feels, space, very, isn't feels very traditional the layout to yeah. me like and we've still got another floor yeah i'm expecting a huge master bedroom. bedroom up there absolutely so let's go and have a look okay right, here we go floor. i think there's two bedrooms up yeah. here so this is six bed right. gosh six bedrooms wow all right first of all the bathroom so this is the arm suite bathroom for the main bedroom wow it's still very light isn't it Oh, that's not a bedroom, that's a dressing room. Could it be a bedroom? Yeah. Well, it's big enough, yes. That, that shower cubicle is gigantic. Right. I'm going to take you across this way, first of all. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Beautiful. Hang on. So you've got this lovely area here. You could have a little desk there you something, could. couldn't you? Look at this. Wow. Epic. Ah, that's what we do Sharon's online for, isn't it? Beautiful. It's not overdress, oh, not too much furniture in it, it's no. just enough, isn't it? So much space. What a beautiful room. So you've got a good view. Tiny windows in here, because you've got yeah. one deluxe there at the back, and then a small, what's that called? A dormer. Yeah. yeah. Yes, at the front. Such a big bedroom, you know, I feel like I can just jump in there, that looks so nice. Lovely. And you've still got loft access as well, so you've got a good yeah. sized loft in that. I'll be very interested to know the uh, dimensions of this bedroom. Yeah. And then last but not least, so actually this is bedroom sized, but they've yeah. got it dressed as a dressing room. So it could be a bedroom, could be a study, a dressing room, another lounge, many, many different yeah. uses for this. It's lovely, isn't it? No. So. Yeah, so we're done. What up the Sudbury? Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. What a fantastic house type. We just yeah. turn you around to look at that view over there. Just take a minute, just to Heritage Park, what a development. Very nice house. Yes. It is a really, really, really little right treat to see them. And it's nice to see a developer that really cares about how their houses look instead of, you know, developing faceless boxes. This has got so much character, hasn't it? It's very nice and we'd really like to know what you think about it. Yeah. If you've enjoyed this video in this house, please give us a thumbs up because we really like that and it's 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 good to get your feedback and um, obviously I will put all of the descriptions um, dimensions everything you need to know about this house in the uh, box down below so don't forget to take a little look at that and we will catch you on our next video so I was just looking down the street and somebody I uh, wondered what you were staring <coughs> at then. artificial grass yeah, installation doing the going gardens. on yeah. but also just to add to that obviously you know like our Facebook page and also leave us a review on there because you guys we can't do it without you yeah take care yourself Thanks see you soon watching.